Hello, I'm Daniil, and welcome to the Mona Project. We here at the Mona Project are continuing in our series of videos with respect to information, inspiration, education, guidance, advice, and I am reminded of the story of the uh, Sanzer Rav. This would have been Chaim Hobstam, who once stood at his window, and he looked out uh, as, pe as people were walking by. He saw a certain Jew, and he motioned for him to come inside. And he asked him a question. Let's say you found a wallet, and it was full of money, a lot of money. And you knew who the person was who owned this wallet. What would you do? And the Jew said, well, I would return the money. And the sons of Rav rebuked him. He said, uh, called him a fool, an idiot, for returning money like that. The man went away somewhat confused. The sons of Rav sees another Jew walk by, motions him in, asks him the same question. The second Jew says, I'd keep it, I'm not an idiot, I need the money. The Rav scolded him for being a, a Russia, a wicked person. A third person walks by. Again, the sons of Rav motions to him. Again, he asks him exactly the same question. This Jew had a different response. He chose his words very carefully. He said, I don't know what I would do in that situation. I guess I'd have to wait until I was faced with that challenge. I know that the Mayatsahara might overwhelm me might convince me that I need the money more than the person who obviously has a wallet full of money. I, my need is greater. On the other hand, the Creator, God, Hashem, might help me beat the Yetzirah, may uh, break the Yetzirah, the evil inclinations grasp on me. As long as I'm not confronted with the situation, I really can't give you an intelligent response. The sons of Rav smiled and said, you gave the correct answer. You possess common sense. We have to know the enemy. Only a fool goes into battle without prior knowledge of what he is fighting. We cannot, we must not underestimate the power and the strength of our evil inclination. One of the reasons behind the success of uh, the Roman armies, the Roman legions for a thousand years, was that they always went into battle presuming that, the, that they were outnumbered by better soldiers. That way, they were prepared for everything. And anything less than that was to them a win. It held them in good stead for approximately a thousand years. The Roman Legion was was very good at killing people. Uh, they had a knack for it. But it was because of this. So in our own war, in our own battle with the, the Yetzirah, with our own evil inclination, don't underestimate its strength. Don't underestimate its knowledge of exactly who you are because the Yetzirah is part of us. It's that built-in little devil on our left shoulder. He knows the buttons to push. He knows exactly what tempts us. That's, we're built this. This is the way Hashem created us with that built-in Yetzirah. Don't underestimate how clever and how resourceful and how persuasive and seductive the voice of the Yetzirah, the evil inclination, is. Go into battle, presuming you're outnumbered by better troops. That way you'll be ready for everything. And so when the Yetzirah tries to fight, hopefully, Bezrus Hashem, with God's help, you can resist and you can choose good. That is our hope. May you all, may we all, be successful in our constant battle against our own evil inclination. May we always come out on top and uh, be the good people that the Creator hopes we will always be 
we will be doing more videos along these lines. Please come back. Please come. Uh, please watch. Please learn. I hope you're finding these uh, videos uh, instructive, inspiring. And until next time, on behalf of the Imono Project, I'm Daniil, and thank you so much.